So now let's see how we can change around the notification settings inside of Microsoft Teams. So to change around the notification settings, you can click on the three dot button right here and then you can go to settings. So once you go around onto the settings, you can go around on the left side where it says notifications right here. So over here, if there's any missed activity, then you'll be emailed every hour as you can see right here. But if you want to change that out to Delhi, then you can go around and do that. Or if you want no emails from Microsoft Teams at all, then you can go around and uh, just choose off right here. So over here, there's the notification style. Right now, it's the uh, Teams built in. But if you want um, it as a default Windows uh, notification, then you can do that as well right here. So uh, the notification will be different once you do that right here. So you can see that the, these are the different channels as you can see. So you will get desktop and activity notification for all activities maybe or custom as you can see and choose what you want the notification for. So personal mentions or team mentions right here and you can choose let's say to show something only in feed right here and so forth as well. So if you want to show it in pin channel you can show it in banner and feed right here and you can also include all replies so that you get notification for everything. You can also reset it back to default if you are uh, if you are okay with whatever was chosen beforehand. So over here you can see that there's chat notification settings as well. So you can uh, enable out mention notification messages and link and reaction notification right here. And similarly, there's meeting and call notifications over here, as you can see. So you can go around and mute it, mute notification during meetings and calls over here as well. And there's people notifications over here. So you can see that you can follow a people status and get, get notified when they appear out, let's say, for example, online or offline right here. So you, just like this, you can see that you can go around and uh, follow out different people as well. And of course, there's other notification options right here, which you can go. And then if someone, you know, joins the team, then you can get so only in feed or get banner and feed notification right there. And that is how you can work around with notification settings to get the notification on the things you want inside of Microsoft Teams. So I hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.